Hi and welcome to the session. Today we will learn about data handling. So first of all let us learn what is data. Data is a collection of numbers gathered to give some information. For example, here is the data showing the number of children in 20 families in a colony. So according to this data, there are two children in first family. There is one child in second family, three children in third family and so on. Now let's see how to arrange the given data in the form of a table using tally marks. So here in the table, in first column, we will take number of children in a family. In second column, we will make tally marks. And in third column, we will take number of families. So first of all, let us take number of children as 1 and let's see how many families have 1 child. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that means 5 families have 1 child. Now first of all we will make the table for number of children and number of families. And at last we will learn how to represent number of families using tally marks. Now let's take number of children as 2 and let's see how many families have 2 children. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. So 7 families have 2 children. Now let's take number of children as 3 and let's see how many families have 3 children. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six. So, six families have three children. Now, at last, we have number of children as four and there are just two families having four children. Now, here we are given that there are 20 families. So, on adding all these numbers, we should get 20. Also, we have 5 plus 7 plus 6 plus 2 is equal to 20. Now let's see how to represent number of families by tally marks. So first of all we have 5 families. So this represents 5. Next we have 7 families. So we have 5 plus 2 that is 7. Next there are 6 families. So we have 5 plus 1 6. And at last there are 2 families. So we have 2. So, we have learned how to arrange the data in a table using tally marks. Now, let's move on to our next topic, pictograph. A pictograph represents data through pictures of objects. Also, it helps answer the questions on the data at a glance. For example, the following pictograph shows the number of computers sold by a shopkeeper on the following days. Here, this symbol represents 5 computers. That means, if we want to calculate that how many computers were sold on Monday, then we need to count these pictures. Here there are four pictures. That means number of computers sold on Monday is 4 into 5. That is 20 computers. Now suppose by looking at this pictograph, 
we need to answer few questions such as day on which maximum number of computers were sold now here by looking at this pictograph we know that on friday there are maximum pictures that means maximum number of computers were sold on friday and the day on which minimum number of computers were sold that will be thursday because there is just one picture that means on thursday minimum computers were sold now let us learn how to draw a pictograph now suppose we want to draw the pictograph for the given data here we are given number of students in different sections of class 6 So here we have section and number of students first of all let us suppose that this picture represents 10 students and this picture represents 5 students now we have section a and there are 30 students in section a So thirty will be represented by three pictures of ten students like this. Now in section B there are forty-five students. So first of all we have ten, then ten more we have twenty. By this we have thirty. Now forty, and now we want five more. So here we have five. So this represents forty-five students. Next we have section C and in section C there are 25 students so let us represent 25 so here we have 25 students lastly in section D there are 40 students so this represents 40 So this is our required pictograph and now by just looking at this pictograph we can make out that there are maximum number of students in section B and there are minimum number of students in section C with this we finish this session hope you must have understood all the concepts goodbye take care and have a nice day